A very good day to you. I'm Hank Gross, MidHudsonNews.com. It's Monday, February 14th. The news today brought to you by the Galleria at Crystal Run. Ulster County lawmakers are considering a local law to raise the living wage of employees of contractors and subcontractors by $5 an hour. But that may still not be enough to live and work in the county. A public hearing on the proposal was tabled, but not before legislator Kevin Roberts, himself a contractor, raised questions. We're going to raise the living wage from 15 to 20. Um, has anybody talked to uh, the contractors or subcontractors to see uh, what that is going to do uh, to their budget? Um, what is this? How is this going to affect the county budget who has to pay more? And how did he come up with the $20 number? Legislator Laura Petit said the living wage in Ulster County is closer to $26 an hour for someone to live and work in the county. Acting Dutchess County Sheriff Kirk Imperati and members of his command staff briefed a legislative committee on various aspects of the police reform and modernization plan ordered by former Governor Cuomo in 2020. Imperati and his staff addressed the number of complaints against deputies received in 2021. County legislators learned there were 23 complaints filed with the Internal Affairs Bureau in 2021. Imperati pointed out the deputies had more than 53,000 contacts or interactions with the public that year. The 23 complaints received represent four-tenths of one percent of all contacts. More news in just a moment. Find over 100 retailers allowing you to spend hours shopping safely at the Galleria at Crystal Run. Enjoy the big brands and the diverse selection of family-owned stores all in one location. The Galleria at Crystal Run offers dining options for everyone with Fuji 110 Grill, Allen's Mediterranean Grill, and Peru Cuisine. Discover the Mid-Hudson Valley's premier shopping, dining, and entertainment destination, the Galleria at Crystal Run. For more information, follow us on Instagram, Facebook, or visit GalleriaCrystalRun.com. A Saturday evening shooting in Poughkeepsie sent a man to the hospital with a gunshot wound to his foot. The incident reportedly occurred just before 6.30 p.m. near the intersection of Mansion and North Clinton Streets. A man was hospitalized as a result of a Saturday evening fire in the Spackenkill area of Poughkeepsie. An Arlington Fire Department engine crew was on the scene moments after the call at 6.30 p.m. Firefighters worked quickly to successfully contain the blaze to the bedroom. Montgomery Town Supervisor Brian Marr made his intention to seek the 101st State Assembly District seat official on Sunday with a rally that brought out about 100 people. Marr, who served as Walden Village Mayor prior to serving in the town level, has issues he would like to tackle if he makes it to Albany. I plan to be an excellent assembly member. I'm a conservative. I'm a Republican. We're going to make sure to do everything we can to fix bail reform. Marr must first win the GOP nomination, as Orange County legislator Kathy Stegenga has also tossed her hat in the ring. The district includes a portion of Ulster County. I'm Hank Gross, MidHudsonNews.com. The news today brought to you by the Galleria at Crystal Run.